morning. We are about a mile and a half in Long's Peak Trail. Left at 4.30. It's uh, 5 o'clock or so. Had a bunch of rain last night, which is not ideal. Got about a six six mile hike up to the what's called the keyhole. Weather permitting, we'll summit from there. But it'll be our first class three. So if the weather's not good, then uh, we won't summit. So let's clear up ahead. We'll just truck along. Enjoying our little hike this morning since we got a little break yesterday. It is foggy out this morning, rain. So pretty though. Everything covered in fog. We will see a good shot when we get up to this clay. We're gonna hike around that bend. We'll see keyhole, but that's essentially where we're going, right at the top of that. We still have about 3,000 feet to climb to get there. We're in the boulder field. The keyhole's right, just right there. Try to eat up there in the sun. The wind will be died down a little bit. And then we gotta decide if we're gonna go through the backside to summit. The group we just passed coming down. Did not summit, but they did say a group did just go through the keyhole. Uh, I'm going a little bit. We're gonna go through and summit or not. That's where we're going if we summit. We are definitely in the boulder field. Bigger boulders now. Heading up to the keyhole. Counted probably about 10 people. Either heading up or sitting up there. Okay. Who's down there? Right at the keyhole, a little shelter. It looks pretty dang windy up there. Some runners that have done it, done it a bunch of times came through. So we'll see. They already went past, so it's gonna be fun. Just like through that boulder field somewhere. See the tents. Oh yeah, it's right there. Especially at the keyhole. It's going right through and round her out. Beautiful. But crazy windy. This little section right here that was rough because it's slick, kind of reach your foot across. You got up better than me. <sighs> That's a cool lake. I'm not that deep. We came from the keyhole, which is right over there where the sun's cresting through. Along and up and down these rocks. I mean, it's around that edge. But. We had to, we were, were we way down there? No. We are heading up here. Oh, yeah, you can see people climbing. See the, those runners that passed us? 
climbing up the face there. That's where we're going to gain all the elevation. And that one coming up. We're not quite up, but that's not really fun going down. Yeah, we still got 300 feet. <laughs> Six days, fourth, fourteener. We did it. Found it. Found it. Doggin. Made it to the top of Longs. Lay in front of Mount Dew and let me have some of it. So. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. So good. Amazing. The bag of chips. Here is the, the survey. The only thing I like about spawns is that you don't have your hands down. Let's head back down the keyhole. You got this edge of this cliff. That's because you gotta go straight down. To the boulder field, back down from the keyhole, heading back down. We're almost to the boulder field. But look at those clouds, those are so pretty. Okay, we're ready to get done with this. We still got a few hours of hiking to do. We are about two miles from finishing. I'm tired. I didn't bring a hat. So, I've been wearing that little skull cap, but it's been bright and sunny. I've got a headache. I just took my skull cap off. My hair looks pretty, pretty cool. I'm tired of wearing it. We're actually down in the tree line now, so we get some shade. That was a good hike. Both enjoyed it. This is the trail down that we hiked in the dark. We're ready to get down. We it is now 1:42. We left at 4:30 a.m. So I don't want to do the math. I'm too tired. My brain's not working, but at least nine hours. Over nine hours. About 5,000, a little over 5,000 feet of elevation gain up at the top, but it was pretty. Perfect day. So, okay, I'm just gonna finish this one up. Last one for our week. <laughs> 